Hey everybody. It's cool that my phone was able to flip around like that. Here I am. I'm in the middle of moving, so you might be wondering why I'm not giving many videos. That's right, Rudy Shard here. I'm not at Orchestra Farm today, but still doing that conducting. And behind me, you will see the house I'm moving into. I've got some family in there right now, so I'm not going to do a whole walk through, but I thought it'd be fun to do a little walk outside. I'll flip the camera. And there's a the trampoline. You can see a slight tear in it, so i got to fix that or get a new piece to it. The back room over here that's got these windows in it has a loft in it, which is nice. There's a lot of live edge features to the house on the interior. That's a little balcony spot. I'm going to hang a fabric, an aerial fabric, off of there so that way you can climb up the fabric to get onto it. A little porch. I got a bunch of renovation kind of things rather than considering them additions to do because look at how much roof just keeps on happening over here. Oh yeah. So, got my rings up. I got a little swing you can't see it because it's behind there but with the yellow string on it. So that garage port is where I'm going to put my little camper. My wife will use that for her studio space and a greenhouse up there. And next to the greenhouse is a little fenced off pseudo garden spot. I say pseudo because the earth has a lot to be desired there. Now up on that, behind the first roof is a little opening up there. In the summer the whole upper roof is coming off. That's a bedroom in the top with the light on inside a staircase that's there. And when that roof comes off, I'm going to take this section of roof that slopes back further and I'm going to raise that up to create a new room space there. And here, we've got some collective firewood area in the back here. So that will remain collective firewood. Yeah, check out that great lighting, huh? Anyway, and then there will be a wall that goes from that post to this post. That wall will make a room and here, ah, the moving process, and I'll seal in this space to have both a mud room coming in from right about there, and I might even put in a little bit of a loft up here. I'm thinking some cargo net. We'll see how that goes. There's the laundry and the door to the kitchen. Wait, check out that handle, huh? Yeah, pretty nice. And I'm looking at transforming this space into a pantry. That's pretty long ways away. But look at on the floor. Oh, can you see that puddle of water? That's exciting to deal with. And look at this. It's practically a seasonal creek running over here. There's also a whole bunch of other people's stuff. You gotta find homes for that because I've got all my own stuff for all my own businesses and my family stuff. You can see the earth back there. That needs a retaining wall to get put in and probably a French drain and pour a bit of a foundation down here for the back wall. The ceiling. It's looking fun. Well, I've got my hands full moving everybody. It's pretty great. You can hear my littlest one inside doing all her awesome good communication skills at one and a half, basically. And there's a whole bigger property here. You can see that the road goes down the way, I should say the driveway. And there's a whole bunch of fun things to happen over there. There's orchards and play areas and a shared studio space. And then further down the hill, there's a forest and a whole bunch of trails. So I'm gonna look forward to walking with y'all in the morning or in the evening and having some lovely conversations. The sea is also like it's hard to see, but to the west over here, it's a walk through the woods, and you're there in like 20 minutes, a half an hour, depending on how quick you do it. Got some scraggly hairs going on here. Anyway, I thought you guys should see a little bit of that. I'll give you a walk through later on in the interior space. But that's what I'm up to right now. Between that and working and rocking the family, my extra time is pretty well spoken for for the rest of this month. I'm not likely to make more of these videos for the moment, but you can be rooting me on if you like. I'm going to try to get some other things accomplished in that time too. And 
I plan to pick up the pace of these videos in February. So, have a great beginning of the year, everybody. Remember, you can like and subscribe to this channel. You can check me out at bendingreads.com. And have too much fun.